So you ready for ready to hear from a caller? Um, oh yeah. We are going to hear from Mike from College Point. And we have a nice story about him, who this guy was. Who, pe If people don't know already, it was Mike Johnson. Now one of the big journalists in the entire wrestling game right now. Mm -hmm. Let's go to that clip right now. It's Mike from College Point. Mike, how are you? Pretty good. Sign me up for that bus trip. You got it. How much is it? I, oh, yeah, it's, I do have the price right here. It's uh, uh, $30 if you're a Booster Club member, 35 if you're not. Okay. You got my number. Yes, I certainly do. Uh, two things. Yes. What is the Slam Jam that they're advertising on USA on Titan program? Okay, Arista Records. Okay, and in conjunction with the WWF, we're putting out another wrestling album. They uh, are. The WWF had two albums previously when it was business was real hot with Epic Records. Hmm, and, I wonder if Piper's new track is going to be on. Uh, it might be. It might be. But they have a compilation like they did with uh, Land of a Thousand Dancers when they had all those wrestlers appearing on their first album. Yeah. They did something similar for this second, uh, this third album, but it's a new record company, Ariston. I believe it's uh, debuting overseas in, e in England first. Yeah, because I know Piper has a new single out. Yes. Has a record single out. Yeah, I, good. I like the effect. I guess these guys need to look over, you know, for uh, something... Uh, cover their bases because of the wrestling business is not doing very good. Maybe they all want to become recording artists. Yeah, but mm -hmm. they got to get the public interested again. Yeah. You know? And I, I think the only way to do that is um, is to get uh, some fresh blood in the business. Yeah, the Have Vince is... McMahon call me up and I'll certainly don the tights <laughs> I and that. I will take on any comer in the WWF. Including Vince Russo? Yeah. First on the list.